Okay, so where we're gonna go right now is we're gonna go see the end of the Oregon Trail. It's a historical museum, basically about the pioneers of the 1800s, kind of like a memorial thing. Um, of course, we can't take Midnight or Buddy in there. They don't allow dogs. But we had to make a quick pit stop at Denny's to grab a bite to eat because we were hungry. Buddy! Good night! Wanna say hi? <laughs> so that's where we're gonna head off is to the end of the Oregon Trail. Oh, it's hot. What? What? So this is looking in from the entrance. So see, you guys can see like the covered wagon over there. There's a little outhouse there. And then you see the big wagon wheels over there. So yeah, we're gonna definitely go check it out. So you can bring dogs here. So you just have to keep them on a leash. So we're gonna go get Midnight and Buddy. Go take them out for a walk. Because I know they're gonna enjoy it. Go for a walk, Midnight? Yeah, you ready to go for a walk? <laughs> Let's go check this out. So we're gonna go check out this little building here. And see what it is. Oh, man, it's a giant cow. Yeah, there's a giant cows right there. Buddy. Wow. Let's see what's inside. Oh, this is just kind of like a little woodshed. How neat. Look at that. Just where they keep the wood. check out some cows over here hey buddy do you see all those cows over there you see the cows <laughs> oh, okay so this is the actual size of the wagons that they had back in the 1800s 1900s there's two huge cows right there oh want to pet the cows buddy See? Pet the cows. Check out Buddy. He's like, he doesn't know what to think of it. Get him, Buddy. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't know what to think. He thinks they're real. That is huge. Wow. Let's go check it out. They have a map up here. The Oregon Trail. Get over here. Let they me. started in St. Joseph, Missouri. And they traveled all the way to Oregon City. Wow, that is a long ways to travel in a covered wagon. You can imagine how it was traveling all that distance that you guys see back there in a covered wagon of all the hardships that they had to face. That's I can't even imagine how tough that must have been for them. That is a long ways, you know, to travel in a covered wagon. Just taking a little walk. At midnight. Midnight! <laughs> Buddy! <laughs> Tiny little garden area over there we're going to go check out. Some beautiful flowers. Gardens. Living history of the Oregon Trail. Some more garden. Moon Star Watermelon. Blue nose peppers, dwarf gray sugar peas. Yummy, those are good. Barlow Road, 
San Barlos Mountain Hood Toll Road was an alternative to rafting the Columbia River when it's dangerous rapids and portage at the Cascades. It was less than at $5 a wagon. It was considerably shorter than Applegate's Southern Route into Oregon. It carried two-thirds of Oregon's trail traffic into Oregon City from the time it opened in 1846. It remained a toll road until 1950. Immigrant traffic declined after Civil War replaced a stagecoach and freight traffic. There's a canoe. Another covered wagon. That's what the actual size of the inside of the wagon looked like. Not much room. This is the nation's longest graveyard. There's people who traveled on the Oregon Trail. There is a lot of people that died along the way among, you know, dropping off their belongings to make their wagons a lot lighter. kind of sad. A lot of women, children, and men died. Okay, so I think we've covered pretty much of everything on the outside, but we're going to go check out the museum. But first, I don't think we can bring the dogs inside, so we're going to go put them back in the car. So there's the entrance to the museum. Such a beautiful day. Of what it would have looked like back in the 1800s, 18, 1900s. Of course, they didn't have a Samsung, <laughs> but I'm assuming they're taking this as a chalkboard. Oops. There's the chalk, the piano, violin, the wood stove, the books. some toys that the children might have had. So this is the schoolhouse. This is where the teacher would have sat. Jasmine, school's in session. Have a seat. <laughs> so we're in the general store area. So 75 pounds of bacon, rice, flour, sugar. That's how would, they would have came. Then of course blankets, yarn, your dishes, candles, and soap. Oh, the soap this one. Your Dutch oven. And some other stuff. Oh, this is like um, homemade medicine. Helps treat sore throats. Here what you see on the wall is the Oregon Trail timeline. Oh, catnip. <laughs> Oh, there's some leeches in that one. Mm -hmm. So this was the doctor's medicine bag. Folks remedies. Okay, sage, hops, that one, and spearmint. Okay, so then they got some other ones back here that they used to 
do natural home remedies. Frontier woman, the love of the mother, and birth along the trail. Very interesting stuff to read. So George Washington traveled to Oregon in 1850 with James Cochran, which is him, who freed him before making his journey. After spending time in Oregon City, Cochran and Washington settled eventually near present-day Centralia. This is the Henderson Farm. So this is what the wagon would have looked like when they had all their stuff. Wow, can you imagine sitting up there in that tiny little one seat? Then here's some clothes. some hats that the men would have probably wore back in those days. Oh. <laughs> it, doesn't, it doesn't work with my hair tie. Yeah, I have a ponytail, so oh, there it goes. <laughs> or you can be Davy Crockett. Oh, I think this one's like, yeah. like this. <laughs> so that is it for this part and I believe through the theater there is another section and then that will end this journey. So here's the last piece. Hmm. I couldn't have been too comfortable. Some wedding dress. Yeah. It's pretty. Okay guys, so I hope you guys enjoyed the tour of this or end of the Oregon Trail Museum. It was amazing. It's like stepping back into the 1800s. Definitely learned a lot by going in there. Got a lot of awesome pictures. So this is going to be the end of today. But overall, we had an amazing time. It was a beautiful day. It was nice to get out. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video and we will see you guys on the next one.